to the new Grey Zone Warfare gameplay. I might be a little bit late, but this is my own personal opinions on all of these things. I'm not even listening in the factors if I could get that to work on this YouTube video, but yeah. Um, I would like to see other people's opinions in the comments, you know what I mean? It would be pretty, pretty cool to see what's y'all's take on the new Grey Zone Warfare. I think, personally, the new graphics are probably going to burn my computer to the ground. But, I do have a pretty old rig, so, yeah. Without a further, further notice, let's get into it. Roger, Raven is in the air and heading to base camp. I'm getting... This is Raven, arriving shortly near your what? position. There's so, so much trees. The scenery looks really nice. It's really nice. I, I don't know what they shot this, the game on. Also, is this some type of, like, base? I'm gonna be stopping the video sometimes through. It's just, like... No, nah, actually, no. We're, we're just gonna let it play out. I think that... They said it's an open world game. And I think that... About open world, I think it's, like... I don't, I don't really like open world... Ugh. World type games. I like... I don't know, it's, I have a uh, taste in this, like, category of type of games, like the FPS shooters. And, what, yo, this, I like it, I like this one, it, the graphics are really good, and the guns look nice. The graphics are really good. Looks like you're gonna be able to drop in with four people instead of five, okay. Helicopter drop in, okay. Is it gonna be like spawn protection or are you gonna be able to shot up the helicopter? Who knows? Oh my, the footstep audio is very silent. Also, I feel like the map is going to be too big and it's going to take a bit longer to run around. I'll keep on running to play through. Really nice scenery. Okay, they pulled it off. They pulled it off. I'm real engine five, right? That'd be good. There's too many bushes, bro. There's too many bushes. You wanna know who I think is gonna be in there? Stink rat. Of course. Okay, okay, some more walking. More walking action. Have you? <laughs> walking simulator. Okay. We're still walking. Little <laughs> scabs. Or something that caps lock is pretty good pretty good actually oh that free look is even better oh my god oh 
No. God. Yo, the gunfire. Why is this so blurry? The gunfire is okay. It's way better than I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be like your scope bouncing up and down. Oh. see some UI scopes are looking good okay okay I like them frogs are too loud <laughs> system works. Oh my, his aim is reloading is quick. Okay, that's good, that's good to know. Oh, slow. <laughs> the right dose. Oh, it's not. You got the heavy wood. You to heal that. Okay. You can the tourniquet. Okay. Boom. What? One bullet just killed him? Okay. Oh, we got a heavy boot again. Good. No. Oh. It looks like I hit him in the shoulder. Okay. Well, that's a light boot. Yo. Why does that take so long? He's running SP. The ammo's doo I can tell. Shooting is really good. I feel like the visual recoil is like really tiny. Like, you don't feel it at all. Or see it.
Now, to be honest, I would imagine um, people just running inside of buildings and like bunny hopping and headshotting people. That's what I think is gonna happen in this game, to be honest. I feel like there's gonna be specified zones where like it's gonna be paid, so like. Okay, alright. <laughs> that was goofy. But I feel like there's gonna be a paid zone like Labs on Tarkov. Maybe take some like inspiration from it. That's what I think. Let me take a better look at that UI. So, okay, okay. Bag is big. Wow, okay. All right, I like it. I like it. Safe walk, two by two. Pockets. And expedition. I'm pretty sure it's just like leave the game. Gear health, little tasks. Oh, there's going to be tasks. Okay. Uh, squad, friends, messages, settings. This is good. This is good. They got intoxication, radiation. Weight is really small. Blood and hydration and energy. He's had a heavy bleed the whole time. I don't know, bro. They, these people move too quick. It's feeling like. And that slow walk is really quick, too. Look how fast they move. So hopefully this thing is like it'll actually stay here longer and it's hopefully not like that day day break or day out or out day out break I don't know it was something everyone was hyping it up during December. I wish it was not this guy's name, bro. He's been hit three times. They don't stack wounds either. I'm pretty sure it does double. Okay, okay. We moved in. We moved in. We moved in. They did a little more shooting earlier. Oh, someone's coughing. Long all bandage. In summary, this stuff looks good and feels good. Well, it feels good from my perspective. But I do think there's a couple things they could work on.
like, um, the AI feels clunky. I watched them, like, run, shoot, they, they feel good, but they're clunky. Like, also the looting sounds good, uh, I'll actually look into that. But I think this is one of the games I might, you know, chill out and play it someday. But the game looks like fun though. I, I would like, I would like to try it out personally. But a couple more things I could go over is like, I don't know, the game just like it took inspiration from uh, many other escape. They're like extraction shooters. It took like it. it it looks good. It's just I probably will, won't play it because like I can't run it on my computer. But this game looks like a game I would play if I could. But from me, the guns look great. The movement is too fast. <laughs> Coming from a Tarkov player, right? But yeah, I think. I think that it would be an okay game. It's giving me Wildlands vibes. Like, you know that that game that Ubisoft get? It, it feels, it's giving me, like, Wildlands vibes. It's very cool. I like this game. I would try it out. But, I think that'll be enough for today, YouTube. Catch y'all on the next one. Peace.